all the time. Like, I seriously can't help it. I'm always falling. It's so annoying. Like, you know what? It's not even the hills. I think it's just me. And my feet, they just, like, give out. So uh, the other day, I came up with this crazy idea, okay, because in my last relationship, I didn't really get any closure, and I'm, like, really big on closure, you know, like, I need closure, like, we, you can't just have this, like, really great, like, things are going good, and boom, like, it's over, like, ugh, it's just, it's literally been driving me insane, you know, and um, it's been driving, it's just been driving me nuts, okay, first of all, who breaks up via text message with, like, no phone call or something, like, you know, just something like that, like, text message, really, like, I understand that we're in this kind of dating world where it's, like, all text messaging and Facebook and internet kind of stuff, but, like, geez, could you have at least broken up with me via Skype, you know, so in my head, I was, like, you know, I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna do what they do in the love movies, like, those romantic movies, I'm just gonna hop on a plane, and I'm just gonna show up where I know he's gonna be, and then he's gonna see me, and I'll get my closure, because in the movies, that's what they do, like, they get on planes, and trains, and buses, on bikes, and they just, like, show up where that person is, and then they see each other, and things are all magical, and miraculous again, and oh, everybody's in love, okay, but in real life, it doesn't really work that way, you get on plane you show up or you just show up at their house or something yeah they're not gonna be excited that that calls for a restraining order okay you're gonna look like a psycho stalker person in the movies it's like like they make stalking kind of like cute and stuff but in real life people just find that shit creepy and no one really likes it you know like in the movies, they will make the girl, like, be all upset, and then she'll leave, and then the guy will just magically know where she is. Oh, she she got on the ferry and went off to that island, to the beach, to where she where her happy place is, and then he shows up there, and she happens to be the only person on the entire beach, gazing out into the ocean, watching the waves crash as she's thinking about her relationship, and where did she go wrong, and she turns around, <gasps> he He's there and oh boom they kiss and it's happily ever after in real life there are millions of freaking people at the beach like you can't just be like oh I'm just gonna go to the beach like Lila's just gonna be at the beach I'm gonna show up at the beach I'm gonna find her no because in real life if your ex found you at the beach and you would turn around and be like what the hell are you doing here how did you find me because he had to maneuver around like a shit ton of people to find you which means he like really stalked you and then that might just creep you out because maybe you went to the beach because you got in a fight with him and you really just wanted to be alone not everybody wants to be followed like they make it portrayed in half these romantic comedies you know sometimes people just want to get on that plane and just leave and just call it quits so after being knocked into my senses and realizing you know like I can't just jump into a plane and like show up there because that's, that's really just going to make me look crazy. And as much as I would love to have that romantic comedy, you know, we get back together, things all good, the fact of the matter is, no, that, that's not what happens. You look, you look creepy and your dignity goes down the drain because you don't just show up at that bar and see that person and you guys see each other. What really happens is uh, they're probably there with a date. They see you and they're like, what the fuck are you doing here? And um, then you hide away in the corner and it, it, it's just bad. So save yourself the trouble and, you know, don't try any of that romantic comedy type stuff because, believe me, I've done it. I've done a lot of that stuff and I'm surprised I don't have any restraining orders. <laughs> I'm just messing with you, but it's probably because I'm so cute and harmless looking, right? Well... Anyways, that's my little tidbit. Bye for now.